Hello PowerPoint users and welcome back to my channel. In this tutorial we are going to create this beautiful animation using PowerPoint. So let's learn how to do it. First, let's go to Insert tab and draw a rectangle shape. Align it to center, remove its outline and change its fill color to white. Now choose Format Shape option and apply Center Offset Shadow Effect. Set its transparency to 10%, size to 70% and blur value to 30 points. Next, go to Insert tab and draw a rounded rectangle shape. Make it completely rounded, remove its outline, and change its fill color to light gray. Now go to Insert tab and draw a top corner rounded rectangle shape. Remove its outline, make it completely rounded, and rotate it by 90 degrees. Align it to center vertical guide. Match its height to back end rectangle shape, and then increase its width as per your requirement. Now format it with two-step linear gradient and change its fill colors using eyedropper tool. Duplicate this shape, change its gradient colors, and then align it to center vertical guide in opposite direction with reduced width. Select all these shapes and then send them to back. Now add the text fields on either side and change their values if required. Now let's enable the animation pane and start animating these shapes. First, select right side rectangle shape, apply wipe animation and change its direction to right. Next, go to add animation option, add line motion path animation and change its direction to right. Now select the line motion path animation and then drag and align its start and end animation points to vertical guide as shown. Finally, start this animation with previous. Next, select left side rectangle shape, apply wipe animation, change its direction to left and then start it with previous. Now go to add animation option, add line motion path animation and change its direction to left. Now select the line motion path animation and then drag and align its start and end animation points to vertical guide as shown. Finally, start this animation with previous. Next, select both text fields Apply Fade Animation and start them after previous. Now select animations of both rectangle shapes and set their duration to 1 second. Now again select all these animations and set its trigger as on click of PNG icon. Here is the small preview of this animation so far. Next select all these elements and duplicate them 4 more times and align all these shapes centrally to slide. Now drag and select bottom four set of shapes, deselect its PNG icons, and then send all other shapes to back. Finally, adjust the width of each rectangle shapes as per your requirement and change the percentage values accordingly. This is not the final step. We still need to do few important adjustments. Now select line motion path animations of each duplicate rectangle shapes and align its start animation point to vertical guide as shown. Make sure to make these changes to all line motion path animations. Finally, add the necessary text fields and then replace each PNG icon by right clicking on it. Choose change graphic and then selecting from icons option. Search for new icon and then insert it. So here is the final preview of this beautiful animation. Hope you all liked it. Stay tuned for more such tutorials.